Hello and welcome to OAP Gaming and The Last Remnant Remastered. In the last episode, if you remember, amongst other things, we did the Cosmo Maiden quest and we fought Barze because we needed some War Dragon Fangs. We needed four to be precise, but we only got three. So I went back in and I got them. And. I didn't need to split Barze this time, and he is a guaranteed capture. So what I want to do also in this episode is just to show you that if you chose to farm Barze, how much gold you could actually get. It is a lot. I think it's 66,000, I think, something like that. So let's just call here and see how much we would actually get. There you go, 66,760. So if you wanted to abuse the Cosmo Maiden quest and repeatedly fight Barze over and over again, you can quickly build up a nice chunk of gold. So, we need to come here anyway because we are going to be doing the Cosmo Fest, which is another side quest for Cheryl. But this time we have to fight a lot of monsters. So, speak to this gentleman again. Yes, we shall do it. There's Shuttle up there. So you don't have to leave this area. Let's do this. You just have to kill them all. Let's do this. And and there are eighty. That's right, keep following me, keep following me. I want to try and link as many as possible. I do, I think we'll just do these, I think. Let's do this! Defeating 16 of these is a guild task unto itself, so if you haven't already, this is a perfect opportunity to do so. Come on, let's kick some A.
getting started. Yeah, Let's everybody's getting hyped. Want to play? We should strike at their flank. They're flanking us? No big deal. That's all you had? <laughs> Sweet! <laughs> uh, guess this'll work too. I'm going in the wrong direction. Let's do this!
Let's do this! should strike at their flank. All right! Piece of cake! Let's do this! <laughs> Come on, let's kick some A! Feel stronger than before. <coughs> Excuse me. So, we've almost done them all. I was kind of hoping to do them a lot quicker, so let me just find all the others. Well, all the others. We've got seven. 
Which I thought we oh they're over there. I thought they came with us. Okay. So you're there. We know you can't be the only one. Or are you? Let me just double check this. Come on out! Mm -hmm. Okay, later. There has to be some more. Because we did, what did we do? 73? And there's 80 altogether. So there has to be at least two more. the only one I can see. You can't have seven in one group, for bloody God's sake. There was seven in it. Well, there you go. What do I know? Come on, finish them off. So that's the 80 armor shells. We now have to fight a couple of eyes. I think they're actually death. And there's two of them. And you have to wait. Damn. Oh, there it is. I've run right. I was so busy talking, I didn't spot it. It's okay. Once we defeat these, that's this quest no. over with. Well, there's a cutscene and then it's off. over with. I really should pay attention. Yes, you can save them. Those guys look pretty strong! Talisman gift, why not? Just to show you it. That. You can stay on your toes. And so can you. I meant to do that!
all you had! <laughs> Sweet! So that is the Cosmo Fest side quest done. And as Cheryl said, you can, if you wish, hire her. So let's just go to the guild and take a look at what she has to offer. You may choose to hire her. I generally don't, if I'm honest. I have used it. I think I've used it about once. There she is. She'll cost you just short of 21,000. And she comes fairly well developed in the evocations. So if you... I don't usually use uh, evocations. That's why I don't generally hire her. But one of these days I will do a playthrough where I do actually use evocations. And I will certainly hire it on that occasion. So there we go. So let's just have a look. Yes, Rago, we know. You keep asking, and I keep telling you yes. Yes, we'll get you those as well. Don't worry. So, that is the Cosmo Fest done. Uh, and I think... I'm going to end the video here. In the next episode, what we are going to do, we are still continuing doing guild tasks. We'll be going back into the aqueducts um, because we need to fight, we need to defeat, should I say, 16 boons, which are like those uh, hydras, torpedo type things, all the ones with the tentacles. And we need a boon fin from there. And Hydra Bristles will be, maybe, depending on how long it takes us to defeat the 16 boons, we might go into Crook Fen, because there is a, a rare we need. So that will be for the next episode. And we are getting very close now. I would say another, what, one, possibly two, maybe three videos away from actually moving the main story on so if you've enjoyed this video please hit the like button 
leave a comment, good, bad or indifferent. I appreciate them all. If you've got any questions about the game, leave them in the comment section and I will do my very best to answer them for you. And maybe even consider subscribing to the channel. It's free, it costs you absolutely nothing. And that way you won't miss a single episode and you will find out what happens in the game. So, I hope you will join me in the next episode. Until then, thank you so much for watching. It really is appreciated.